Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Ali or Alz, and I hope that you guys are all having a great day as always. For today's video, we're going to be building Kagome's house from the anime Inuyasha. So to start off, you're going to want to get stone and go seven across, then go over one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, actually go back two, so we're going to go five. So just do five when you get to each side, so one, two, three, four, five, right? Now go over to the next side and go over one, two three four five and then once you're done with that we're gonna go over about 25 Okay guys, so now that you're done with that, we're going to get our white concrete and go up about four blocks and just do this with each side. We're going to be filling this in, so um, you can start filling it in now if you want to or you can just start building up the outline on each corner. Also, I do recommend using a Swiftness 2 potion. It just speeds up the process really fast and just makes it a lot easier. Alright guys, so now once you're done with that, we're going to be getting some like stone blocks and we're just going to go across two and this is how we're going to start off our roof. So this part's a bit confusing so just try to pay as much attention as you can. Just go over two and then it's basically just, it's pretty simple. We're just going to keep going across like this and then basically just go up um, one half each time and just until both sides meet.
Alright you guys, so once we're done breaking that roof, we're just going to get our white concrete and on each corner we're going to build up about 8 blocks and so just do that on each corner of this part and then we're going to just be filling that all in. Alright you guys, so once you're done filling in that wall, we're just going to start on to our second part of the roof and just get our stone blocks again. We're going to go two, we'll fill in two on each side and basically it's just the same thing that we did with our first roof the last time. We're just going to keep building it up with the stone slabs until they meet and connect to about like a perfect...
So basically with this store, you're just going to be building or breaking. So the seven blocks that we first placed, we're going to be breaking between those. So just about on each side, it's going to be spaced about five blocks over, which is how you'll know where to put the door. And then it's just going to look pretty much like this. And then once you guys are done with that, we're going to move on to our windows. And uh, also I just put some blue glass there for the, um, the entrance. But as we come over to our windows, we're going to be, um, hold on, as we, we're going to place some um, oak sign here real quick. Okay, so now that you're done with that. We're going to go on to our window part um, section and basically just line up about the middle here, try to make it even. We're going to break three and then go over two more and it's going to be about a five block break over to the left. And then you're just going to fill the first two left in with green terracotta and then the rest of the window in with like light blue glass. And you can use like regular block glass but I like to do this. Um, half glass it just makes it look a little bit more nicer then I just filled in this part with iron bars and then coming over to this next side um, the windows basically it's a bit more we're gonna be built like breaking the windows a bit more down like so that one's gonna be higher up here on the front and then on the sides over here, I'm going to go over just about two blocks and then break three up until there's like one white block at the top, um, like dividing it from the roof. Then same thing here, green terracotta, and then just fill it in with your glass. And then the next window that I um, ended up placing, I didn't necessarily um, break it by a certain amount of blocks. I just kind of randomly did it. So you can do whatever you think looks best for this next window. I just kind of did it somewhat in the middle of uh, the two, like the two sides. And then just for the bottom windows, you're just going to basically do the same thing. I lined them up with the top windows. And then just break those and do the same thing and with the green terracotta in your glass. Alright, so then once you guys are done with those windows, it's basically just the same thing um, on both sides. I just tried to line up the windows with each other and then just line up the front, like the top with the bottom. And again, just try to line up like both sides. And then just come down and do the same thing with the bottom windows.
All right, so then once you guys are done with that, the next thing um, that I ended up doing is basically just, uh, I started filling in like the sides with the, the iron bars again. Um, and I also just, right here I did some stone brick slabs just to kind of make some more like details for the outside of the windows. And then right here, there's kind of like a little balcony area, so I just got my stone slabs again and just kind of, I would go out three blocks, um, and then you'll just kind of see what I did here. I was still just trying to figure it out as I went, um, but I did get some oak fence to kind of, like, so you see right here you just build up this part, just to make it connect to the roof. And so yeah, just make sure that it's built out about three. Um, so then the next thing that I basically did with this is I just kind of filled in this second block and then don't fill in that block. We're gonna, I'm going to be deleting that. But I also just, you know, put in a bit more of a roof for that. Okay, so yeah, this block right here. I'm going to be breaking this, um, and then just doing it at the top instead of the bottom. That way we can line it up with our iron bars, just to make it more like a balcony. And that's basically what that's going to look like right there. And now that you guys are done with that, basically what I show here with the windows is just me putting iron bars. Um, on each side of those. And yeah, that's just every window that you're going to be doing this with. And then on the sides here, um, I basically just got um, this uh, chiseled stone bricks block and I just placed it on the right side of each window. And I don't know if they're like generators or anything, but that's just kind of, you know, just to kind of give it more of a fill of that from the picture. And then um, right here, so I moved on to the front area. Um, on the left side, we're gonna get like um, like stone brick, a wall, and we're gonna be using this um, to go to the middle here and just build up about two. And then I just got my stone brick slab, made a block there, and then on this right side, I went back to my stone brick wall, and I just kind of, as you can see, I just made kind of like a pipe looking thingy, just sitting there, just just chilling. And I mean, that's kind of basically the sum up of this whole build. Um, so there isn't really any more to it unless you want to do the inside. I just kind of filled those in with uh, like the um, like the floor with uh, just regular wood. And then just right here, I'm just adding in like another door with like a window. So I just got my green terracotta and placed it right here. Um, and then I just got a regular wooden button and placed it in the middle um, of the door just to make it look more like a door. And yeah, so it's just kind of a door that doesn't open, but it makes it look nice. So that's how I did it. And that's the sum up of the build, guys. So I hope that you guys did enjoy. And I'm going to show you what I did for Kagome's room. So thank you guys so much for watching.